Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Over the past 10 years, Solar Industries has developed several defense products which includes high energy materials such as HMX, RDX, TNT and other compounds, composite propellants for Pinaka, Akash, Brahmos, etc., explosive fillings of ammunition, mines, multi-mode grenades and warheads, fuse, pyros and igniters and rocket missile integration. In August 2022, the Defense Acquisition Council cleared Solar Industry to compete in bids to manufacture two versions of Pinaka rockets. The firm has submitted a proposal to manufacture two high-mobility long-range precision rocket system, Maheshwarastra 1, which is having a range of 150 km, and Maheshwarastra 2, having a range of 250 km, under Make 2 category of the Make in India initiative. The firm is the first in private sector to qualify for manufacturing the rockets. Solar Group would participate in upcoming Pinaka tenders and its commercialization is expected to commence from the financial year 2024. Recently, in an interview, the Solar Industries Chairman S.N. Nuval has said that his firm has been granted permission to manufacture hard kill measure integrated with laser as well as missiles to neutralize the UAVs. As per S.N. Nuval, the system will be completely ready in next two years. This system can be deployed on a stationary as well as mobile platform covering various aspects of threat environment. The counter drone system is named Bhargavastra, which can destroy up to 16 drones in 7 seconds and deploy 64 missiles through its system. The company has already tested the mechanism. As per Nuval, the system will be ready in two years. Once developed, it will be quite effective against the swarm drone attack. EEL, a subsidiary of Solar Industry, has also developed armed hexacopter. This can carry fragmentation come blast warheads weighing 1 to 10 kg, which is also under development by the firm. These warheads can neutralize soldiers in open and can also neutralize hostile soft skin targets within a lethal radius of 8 to 30 meter. The hexacopter drones can carry single or multiple explosives that can be dropped from a height of 300 to 500 meter with an accuracy of 3 to 5 meter at the target end. The firm has also developed Nagastr series of lottery munition. Nagastr 1 is hand launched lottery munition, also called LM0. It can carry 1.5 kilograms of warhead to a range of 15 kilometers. Nagastr 2 is a tube or catapult launch lottery munition, also known as LM1 that can deliver 4 kilograms of explosive warhead up to a range of 25 kilometers. It will be a man-portable system in backpacks with a total all-up weight of only 20 kilograms, which also includes communication control, payload and launch mechanism. Nagas 3 is a vehicle-mounted tube or cassette launch lottery munition LM2 that can carry 5 to 10 kilograms of warhead to a range of 40 to 100 kilometers. This will be a rugged and mobile system in which six lottery munition, launcher, generator, UPS and other support equipment can be accommodated on a one-ton class of vehicle. In March 2022, the company has successfully tested its lottery munitions in high altitude conditions of Ladakh in association with Z-Motion Autonomous System. Later, in April 2022, the solar industry has also acquired 45% stake in the Z motion. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.